dreams come real. Hey, babe, I'm so hungry and famished, and it's only a meal that can quench this thirst. Okay, don't worry. In five minutes, your food will be ready. Five minutes? Yeah. Promise? <laughs> I promise. Okay. <laughs> Five I don't think any woman cooks as much as, I mean, as better as you do. Aww. <laughs> Thank you, baby. How do you get all these sweet words you always tell me all the time? When you love someone deeply, it comes natural. Come here. <laughs> Come here. That's right. I love you so much. Mm -hmm. I love you too. <laughs> Alright, babe, so um, when are we going to have you know, the other food when I get back from work. Hmm? You're so nutty. <laughs> Definitely, you're gonna have lots of it. Mm, mm -hmm. That's my girl. <laughs> I'm yeah. glad you like it. Okay, babe. All right, let me give you some. <sighs> I'm fine. <laughs> okay. You okay? <sighs> right? Ah! <sighs> what is it? Oh my god! Oh my god! 
he's gone. Stanley. It's okay. You'll be fine. No. There's thing. He was here. Teasing me. Laughing. and I couldn't help him. Guests are asking for you. I think they want to take their leave. Okay. After dreams comes reality. smoke but there is a fire to it yes wish she's an babe are you going out yes I am. at this time what is wrong with the time what is late 9 p.m is not late Besides, I'm going to hang out with my guys, so we'll go to a bar, drink away our soul. But what about me? I'll be home alone, and you know I don't like being by myself. And who is saying you should be home all by yourself? Okay, so can I come with you then? Hmm? That is not possible. You're going to be the only female in our midst, and it doesn't make sense, please. Doesn't matter. I can just hang out with you. If I'm please. Please. If you want to go hang out, you can, I mean, go hang out with your friends. No one is stopping you. Am I stopping you? Nobody's stopping you. Why are you treating me like this, Stanley? Why? Since we got married, we hardly spend time together. We don't even do anything together. I, I just... Uh, if, if I'm a please, okay? This is not the right time for this now. Right? This is not the right time. I just lost my friend. My best friend. And I want to mourn him. Let me mourn him in my own way. What are you doing here so late? Is it for my okay? Thank 
because I can't bear any other loss. So what are you doing here? <sighs> I was supposed to be in a beer bottle with my friends drinking. <laughs> I... I suddenly found myself coming here to... to see you. So how have you been coping? I'm fine. You don't look fine to me. My husband just died. Am I supposed to be fine? be back home. So I won't be lonely. Call it a team. I keep wondering how she will feel when she hears the bad news. The thought of it scares me. She'll be so torn apart. I know. Don't worry, I'll we'll tell her together if you don't mind. It's not necessary. I can handle it. It's done. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. You've been a pillar of supports and comfort since this tragedy happened. Thank you. Oh, you don't have to thank me. We both know why I'm doing it. This to happen, right? What? Don't you play dumb with me! She wanted this to happen, and that is why you came last night pretending to check up on me, right?
<laughs> Rola, you know that is not true. I am not sex tab. I have a wife from him. What's going to happen? So why are you pretending? Why are you acting up? Get out of my house now! I'm sorry. Please. Please. What other lies do you have to tell? I had so much to drink, so... I had to go to Henry's place to spend the night. Which Henry? Henry, my friend, of course. Don't you ever get tired of lying? Well, I'm not constructing lies, I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> the truth? Well, I called him. Do you want to know what he had to say? Hmm? I forgot, please. He said they waited for you at the bar all night yesterday and you never showed up. So where were you? Where were you, Stanley? I mean, how were you able to call Henry? How? How did you get his number? Hold on. So all you're concerned about is where I got his number, yes, right? But, but but I want you. I want you not to speak to any of my friends without my consent. Mm. Did I warn you? I see what you're trying to do. I see it clearly. You're trying to shift the blame from you to me, right? <laughs> it's not working. Okay. Hmm. I did not sleep at Henry's place. So you see, was it so hard for you to tell the truth? Hmm? Okay, so where did you sleep? I knew I was kind of tipsy, so I had to get... I had to lodge in a hotel. Uh, before you come with the next question, I slept alone. 
Who is she? Who is she standing? Fuma, you're so unbelievable. Who the hell is she standing? Well, I'm not cut out for this today. Please. Stanley!
Everything is going to be fine, okay? Listen, Mommy is promising you that I will do everything to make sure that you're fine, okay? Okay, don't cry. My baby. <laughs> Where are you going? To my room. I'm tired. Okay. Uncle Stanley, yeah. can you please walk me to my room? Of course. Excuse me. Okay. I'm happy she still finds a father figure in him. I don't know why Bright decided to leave us so soon. I never saw this coming. You know, life can, can be somehow. You can never predict what happens. You can't. I feel so lonely and empty. Like a huge part of me is gone. It's really funny because that is exactly how I feel too. I don't understand. So, Stanley has been so cold to me lately. How do you mean? You know what? I don't want to bother you with this. You have so much on your plate right now. No. It's fine. Okay? The distraction is good for me. Well... Um... <clears throat> you know, she was really tired. Merely help her back hit the bed she slept off. Thank you so much. It's okay, you're welcome. So, uh, we should be on our way now. Okay, you know what? Don't forget to call us if you need anything. And I mean anything at all, okay? I won't. Uh, oh. See you soon. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't feel like sleeping. I had a very busy day today. Please. I don't need to rest. Not again. I'm getting tired of your constant rejection. Constant rejection? Yes. I mean, you've not touched me since I had the miscarriage. Well, that is because the doctor said you need to heal properly. The doctor said two weeks, and that's long past. I did not know. Sorry. That's Jeez. because you don't care. You don't care, Stanley. If I don't say that, please. You know I care so much about you. It's just that my emotion has been all over the place ever since Bright State. Sorry. Would you like to talk about it? Yes. Okay. But definitely not this night. I need to rest. Okay. Alright then. Get some rest. Thank you for your understanding. 
Everything feels weird and different without that. I know. I wonder if he misses us the way we miss him here. I don't know. When people die, it feels like they are sleeping. Do you mean they can't feel anything? Yes. <laughs> Mom. Will you be alright? <laughs> yes. We will be fine. I wonder how Sandra coves. Who is Sandra? My classmates. She lost her parents in a car accident a month ago. Oh my goodness. She's so strong. She said that her parents would not want her to be sad. Right. Even your dad would want us to be strong. Uh, that reminds me. I'm thinking of changing your school. Why? My baby. Because I want you closer to me. I want you close to me. Are you okay with that? I don't know. I love my school and I already have many friends. Besides, the time is almost over. That's true. You can't change your school now because the time is almost over. But we have to think about it later, okay? Okay. My baby. You have to eat, okay? Okay. <laughs> Are you okay? 
Do you not like this food? If you don't want to eat, then say it instead of playing with the food. going to now? What are you doing here? This is my house too. Have you forgotten? I want us to talk. About what? Can we just go up and talk? No. No, we can't talk here. Stanley, stop wasting my time. I just dropped my daughter off in school. I'm tired. I need to rest. I can't stand up for me anymore. What do you mean? Everything she does irritates me. And how is that my business? If you feel that way about your wife, then you need to see a counselor because I cannot do anything about it. But I love you. Don't you ever say that again. But that's the truth. Go home to your wife, Stanley. And you are my home, Rhoda. Stanley. If it's about the other night, it was a mistake and I still feel guilty about it. So do not think your drama can lure me into your bed again. No, this is not about sex. Ruda, this is not just about sex and you know it. I want you in my life. I really do. I have waited for so, so long. Stanley, if you ever disturb me again about this, I swear I am going to tell your wife about this, and I mean it! Go on. Go on, tell her. Tell her everything. Eventually, I'm going to divorce her, so just go ahead and tell her what you want to tell her. What? And trust me, I'm not going to lose you again. Hello? Ifama? That's strange.
Okay, I, I will call him. And then I'll get back to you, okay? All right. Bye. What are you still doing here? I am not leaving till we talk. Stanley, your wife is worried about you and she just called me. You have to go home. If you want me to leave, then let's talk. Stanley, what do you want from me? You are a married man. You've been single. Is what it is going to take. Then so be it. Stanley, what do you want from me? What I want you. Crazy. Crazy love with you. I miss you. I miss you too. But you have to go home. Taking my calls. Babe. Good morning, babe. Good morning. Are you still upset about last night? Nope. Stanley, please. I don't want you to leave the house this way. And how am I leaving the house? You're clearly still upset. But can we please just talk about it? Babe, I'm late for work. Okay? We can do that later. But for now, I have to go to work. So what is the problem? It's Tony. He's been acting up lately. How do you mean? It's all started after Bright's death. I mean, I know we've had our problems, but it has never been this bad. I promise it has never been this bad. Ifoma, stop crying, okay? Maybe you need some space. Some space? 
for me. People grieve differently. Maybe he just needs time to be all by himself. What are you sure? Time. That's what I think. Okay, what? Can you do me a favor though? Just just a little favor. Of course, if it's in my power, why not? Can you talk to him for me? Please. this would help? I know it will. It's you. I know it will. Okay. Okay, I'll try. I'll, 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 I'll do my best, okay? Thank you. Thank you so much. You have no idea how much this means to me. Thank you. It's fine. You Thank have to you. stop crying. <laughs> Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so tell me how it's work. You know you're like uh, one of the best makeup artists. I know, right? <laughs> but nothing is happening right now. I'm just, I'm just here. Don't worry. Everything will be fine, okay? Okay. Give me something to drink. All right, no problem. I, I feel so much better now. I mean, I needed to talk to someone. Thank you so much. It's fine. <sighs> Your wife asked me to talk to you. Apparently, you've been a bad boy. Is that so? Okay, then. Talk to me. Stan, you have to do better. And I'm serious. What does that mean?
Oh. Hey, babe. <laughs> How was your night? It was lovely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, what would you like to have for dinner? Uh, anything. <laughs> anything. Okay. Anything light. Very light. And um, I'll be coming back late tonight. Why? The building project is actually starting today. So I have a lot to do. Okay. Well, I guess I have to figure something out with dinner then. Please do. Talking about work. Mm -hmm. I got a job in mm -hmm. Enugu. Really? Yes. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So when are you going for the job? Mm, this weekend. Oh. <laughs> I'm happy for you. I'm happy you finally got the opportunity to do what you love to do. <laughs> But I'm going to miss you. I'll miss you too, babe. I yeah. stop saying you miss me because I might just change my mind. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to work. I want to work. I mean, I really need to work. Oh. Thank you. Well done. I wish I was the one taking you to the airport. I know, right? <laughs> I don't know what happened there. The office just fixed a Zoom meeting. I didn't know what I'm going oh. to do. It just came up just like that. It's okay, babe. Hustle comes first, right? <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to miss you. And I'll miss you too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Right. Bye. Uh, driver, sir. Please drive slowly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you safely. Yeah. This is my life you're carrying. Oh, take care of her. <laughs> take care of her. <laughs> Thank you very much. After our dreams comes reality. There is a smoke, but there is a fire to it. Yes, wishes are not hers. The ride might be sweet, but is our journey guaranteed? Oh, oh, oh. oh, 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 oh. This is what I've been missing. Come on, stop being naughty. I'm not, I'm serious. <laughs> Even brides couldn't achieve this much. No. <laughs> As a bride was a perfect gentleman in all ramification. Trust mm -hmm. me, he was. You can say that again. Miss Jen do so rest in perfect peace. Amen. Amen. So I was thinking if we can just, um, maybe we'll just hang out tonight. What? You mean like a date? Yeah. You know, like a date. Uh, no, I, I don't want to go. Come on, babes, we've been in this room for two days straight without going out. You know, I just want to enjoy this moment. And you know our time here will soon be over. Hmm? Well, you're <laughs> right. We just have a night left, right? Yeah. <sighs> I'd rather just stay in here. Unless maybe you want to, then it's fine. 
I quit. I just stay here. <laughs> Come here. And enjoy the rest of our life together. <laughs> <laughs> so why don't you come to Mama? And I love Mama so much. Um, <laughs> Hey, where are you rushing to? Ah, to the airport to pick it from her. She's back? Oh yeah, she fell ill and um, she decided to come back. So why didn't you tell her that you were busy? Or something, so she can sort herself out. Well, she's going to suspect me. Have you forgotten we agreed to play this whole thing on the low key? Well, I changed my mind these past few days. I can no longer share you with her. I can see someone is jealous already. Why are you jealous? I am serious. I'm okay. I just feel a bit dizzy. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. You need to see the doctor. Right? Okay. okay, well, can you get me a glass of water, okay, please? I'm some water. Come on, just rest your head, please. <sighs> Hello? 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 Um, babe, yeah. someone called the um, business partner just called you and they were not saying anything. Oh, oh, okay, yeah. Um, uh, he wants to partner with a company for a particular um, project, but I mean, this, this company is not up to what we expect. You should call them back, though. No, I'll definitely call it's them back. business. I know. So just drink your water. <sighs> and you need to rest. We'll go and see the doctor later in the day, okay? Alright, good. Okay. Alright. Thanks. Stress. So stressed. That river comes reality. Why haven't you been picking my calls? Oh, that is because you always call at the wrong time. What does that mean? What it simply means is that you always call when the phone is not with me. It's either the phone is with the phone or I am not close to the phone. And whose fault is that? I'm sorry. Just that for my sick. Very sick. And she needs me now. I do not care about her. All I care about is why haven't you called a lawyer? Did you hear what I just said? 
I said, my mama is sick. And she needs me now. So the word should stop, right? Rura, did you call me here so we'll start quarreling? Is that why you invited me here? Stanley, I thought you were desperate about getting a divorce. What has changed? Nothing. Nothing has changed. Things are still the way they are. Just that I want to work this whole thing myself. My own way. After dreams comes reality. There are easy smoke, but there is a fire to it. You better hurry up. I am tired of being the other woman. Uh, to the salon, to the salon. I just want to trim my hair. Your hair? Yeah. But it looks nice to me. I, I'm, I'm in the beard. I just want to reduce it a little. That's it. All right then. Yeah. That means you'll be back pretty late. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, because I have to go hang out with the boys as well. I'll be back before you know it. All right? Okay. Come on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Comes reality. There is a smoke, but there is a fire to it. Yes, wishes are not hers. The ride might be sweet, but is our journey guaranteed? Oh, oh. Oh, 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 how did we go from that to this? Oh, 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 of all the women in the world, it ought to be Rhonda. 
your best friend's wife. She's no longer his wife. Bright is dead. Bright is dead. I'm sure he must be rolling in his grave because of the thought of you. You disgust me. You disgust me, Stanley. Well, I, I understand. And I'm sorry you had to find out the way you did. Wow. This must be the best apology I've ever heard. The best, I tell you. I wanted to tell you. I was looking for the perfect time to tell you. How long has this been going on? If, if I'm... Uh, please... So... Brother is the reason you've been acting up. Huh? Your best friend's wife. Your best friend's wife, Stanley. Please, stop saying that. Okay, is it not the truth? Huh? Okay, this is the truth. The fact of the matter is that I and Broda, we've known ourselves ever before Bright knew her. I knew Broda before Bright did. Don't you have lecture at 2 p.m.? It's your to do. You have 10 minutes to get ready. <laughs> 10 minutes. I don't think I want to go for that lecture, sir. Why? Ruda, see, this is the first time we are spending time together in the whole of this week. Eh? I want to enjoy every moment with you. Every moment. Stan, to be honest, I do not like the idea of you missing classes because of me. You don't understand, you're worth everything. I can miss everything but not you. I don't want to miss you at all. That's the truth. Ah. <coughs> ah, hi, Miracle. Hi there. Hi. Wow, both of you know great at all. What are you doing here? Eh? We have lectures by two. What are you doing here? Are you not supposed to be in school by now? Let's see who is talking. Are you not supposed to be in the same class? But I was banking to get the notes from you now. You're supposed to represent me if I'm not there. I represent you when you're not there. That's how it should be. Don't bother. The course website probably won't be coming today, so the lecture has been cancelled. <laughs> Wait, Stan, why are you happy? I have no lectures. Thank God. Is that what you're saying? Thank God. Uh, but you're the one at loss. So you don't know that they have turned my roommate to something else. The only thing he thinks and talks about now is love. Okay. <laughs> Talking, who asked you? Blah blah blah. Who asked you? Eh? Don't you know as you came you saw that two people are in love that are inside the room? You're supposed to go back. Give us some privacy. That is how it should be. It's fine, it's fine. I'll be leaving now, okay? So soon. Um, yes. I hope I... you're not going because of me. Oh, no, no, I have to go to the salon. Oh. I just remembered. It's okay, fine. don't worry, I'll go with you. Uh, yes, now let me you know keep you company while you're doing your hair. That's so sweet. Thank you. I want okay. to follow you and choose your hairstyle. Stan, um, may I call see you later? May I go eat the room, eat the room. We are going to the salon. Eat the room. <laughs> Let's go. Boro. It's my mom. She was rushed to the hospital. What happened to her? I don't know. I was asked to rush back home. I hope it is not something very serious. I hope so too. Okay, let me walk you to the park. Let me do it. Okay. Ah. Thank you. Okay. Did you pack all your things? Yes. Mm. 
I would have given you something, but I don't have enough money on me. I know. Uh, when you get home, make sure you come. Okay. Did you hear what I just said now? Hello? Doctor, um, I'm, 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 I'm sorry. I, I got carried away. Um, what were you saying? Like I said, she needs to have this surgery as soon as possible. Um, doctor, like, like how much will it cost, please? 500,000. Excluding drugs and uh, other things. <laughs> doctor, 500,000 there. Yes. Try as much as you can to make it possible. Yeah, yeah, you better for us. Mm. Okay. Mm. My guy, I found out. Yeah, what's up now? Why, why is your face like that? <sighs> Rhoda. Yeah? It's Rhoda. You sure, right? Rhoda is alright. <laughs> but her mom is supposed to go. Her mom is supposed to undergo surgery. And the amount they're telling them is just outrageous. Ha! This is not a good one. Though. Where are they going to get that kind of money from? I don't know. I don't know. Her, her, her mother is just a petty trader. They don't have any member of the family that can help? I don't think they do. Yeah. I don't think they have. That is where the problem is. That is where the problem is. I am her boyfriend. Eh? And she has a problem like this. At least I should help. And I should just... I, I should just help them somehow, give them something. Huh? But I don't have. Huh? I'm not get. Who? I understand how you feel. But Stan, what can you do? I called her some moments ago. Oh, she, she was just crying. Huh? Crying, crying, crying. I don't even know what to tell her. I don't know what to say to her. I, 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 I don't know. Huh? Why is, why is this life like this? I don't just understand this life sometimes. Why would things like this be happening to people that are managing? They are managing to survive. Why? Isn't this ridiculous? I just don't understand. You see this life? I don't understand. This life no balance at all. This life no balance. The life is not balanced. Every, I mean, it's so imbalanced. Calm down, my guy. Everything is gonna be alright, okay? Just take it easy. Sorry, do you have nail cut on? Let me check. 
Um, sir, sorry, we, we don't have. I'm um, sir, please. Are you sure you don't need any other thing? Please just look around. We have drinks, uh, egg, granola. It's, it's okay. Please. It's okay. All right. I mean, I. I was just bothered by your mood, so I decided to stop by and see if you can share what the problem is. Do you mind to share what the problem is? I'm sorry, sir. I'm not comfortable doing that. Okay, then please don't look at me as a stranger. I mean, considering the fact that we're just meeting for the first time, all right? But look, whatever it is, feel free to share with me. I don't like to see women cry. I'm telling you. <laughs> not a lot has changed. Nothing, no, nothing. <laughs> oh. Man, oh, well, right. So you're trying to tell me that you just travel just like that. Traveled and forgot about me. I can't be so did do now. Eh? I know. You cannot just travel, just bench me like that. No call, no nothing. I'm sorry. Okay? I'm, I promise I'm going to tell you all about it, but that's the story for another day. Yeah, that's true, Sha. So, just me, just me. What's the latest thing now? Well, right now, all I'm interested in and focusing on is moving on to the next stage of my life. <laughs> that is next stage like everything. You want to just move to the next level, including getting married. Yeah, so, and I have found the lady I want to get married to. <laughs> now, now. <laughs> ah, no time more. Look at if you see this lady. Ha! Ah, she is the most beautiful lady I have ever met. Right, this one you're sounding like this. Yeah. <laughs> Seems you're 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 deeply like inside deeply in love. Yes, oh. Ah. By the time you see this lady, then you will understand why I'm deeply in love with her. <laughs> I do this is scared. Okay. Her name is Rhoda. Yes. She she's in our university. She's one of our students. And she's studying English. Are you okay? Right. <laughs> yeah, my mom. <laughs> Honestly, you see this one, there's no going back. I will definitely wife her. Right too. Yeah. <laughs> uh, can you tell me why you suddenly stopped taking my calls? Stan, please, not here. Um, can I just come to your hostel later to talk to you? Well, there will be no need for that. Is there something you want to tell me? Hmm? Fine. I'm getting married. That's why I'm not picking your calls. Bright is my childhood friend. And he. He paid for my mom's surgery. Please. He traveled and we, we lost contact. No way to contact him. No way for him to contact me. Please don't tell him anything about us. Stan. Stan, please, please. Stan. Stan.
This is not the right time to say this, but I have no choice. What more can you possibly say that would surprise me? Hmm? I want a divorce. Comes reality. There is a smoke, but there is a fire to it. Yes, wishes are not hers. The ride might be sweet, but is our journey guaranteed? What is it? Ifoma. She tried to kill herself. She's in the hospital. Oh. I have to go to the hospital. No, you don't. Did you hear what I just said? Stanley, how does that concern you? If Ifoma is tired of living and she wants to die, it's her choice. So why don't you just relax? Stanley! Don't you go anywhere. Stanley!
Hi. Are you okay? Are you okay? Would you like to talk? Yes, what I call Is your all still around here? Not that far. Okay, okay. Well, would you like to talk? Because you look like you're in a terrible state right now. I don't want to talk. I just want to go home. What do I want to say? Man, at the love of my life left me for another man. Sorry to hear that. If you don't mind, can you just talk to me? Tell me more about it. I mean, broken hearted people also need to be cared for. I, I, I know you don't know me, but I'm here to listen. If you want to share. I just want to go do, do you mind if I walk you to the taxi park or something? I don't mind doing that. I'm um, Ifoma, by the way. Nice to meet you. And your name? Congratulations. I'm so happy. Hey! It's not easy. I see it. Last, last. Hey! Who's that? Are you spitting it? Check, check, check. No, not all. Hold on. Congratulations oh, on your graduation. Thank you very much. Thank you. So I got this for you to celebrate your graduation. For me? But who? Yes. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is good. I hope you like it. Wow. Wow. Okay, that's a lot of wow. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand. That's because I'm surprised. So nice. It's, 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 oh, it's thank nothing. you very much. It's nothing. I mean, I know how hard it is to graduate in this our demanding educational system. So I decided to get you something nice to celebrate. Hi. You can say that again. Oh. Yeah, we're yeah, well, really surprised. <laughs> you, know, you, know, you, know, you know how it is. Now we're done with um, school. Mm -hmm. So we have to go for uh, service. Mm -hmm. But people don't understand what that NYC truly means. It means now. Your suffering continues. <laughs> <laughs> so now the labor market should wait for us because we are coming. coming. <laughs> well, well, well. You have nothing to worry about. I have already spoken to my uncle about you. Remember, I told you he owns a construction company. Wow, that's so nice of you. <laughs> you, you, you did that? Yes. In fact, he's looking to employ new engineers to join the company. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> no that's problem. good, that's good. You have really tried it for me. That's it's, a good one. It's, it's nothing really, it's nothing. So, are you still traveling out of the country? Yes, of course. I'm already working on it. Okay, you go. <laughs> I wish you all the best. All the Thank best. you so much, darling. You're welcome. Welcome. Thank you very much. You're, You're so welcome. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Please forgive me. I have realized my mistakes. I held on to the past instead of letting it go. And that is wrong. The 
This is all my fault. You did this to yourself because of me. I'm sorry. I thought I told you I was coming to see you. I no longer trust anything you see. Stop. I haven't set my eyes on you in the past one week. What is going on? See you. Just go home, I'll come so we can talk. I'm not going anywhere. I am here. So let's talk now. I can't. If Oma is still in the hospital. And I need to go take care of her. Stanley, you were supposed to be divorcing her, not babysitting her. And I'm sorry. I can't divorce her. For my scarring my child. So? Is that all you have to say? So? She could be playing tricks on you and you know that. Including trying to kill herself. Oh please! Woman in love can do anything. You just don't understand. You're so unbelievable. You see this thing called relationship between us? It's over. I am done with it. What? Yes, you heard me. I mean, we shouldn't have started it in the first place. It was a mistake. It's over now. This is time for me to go take good care of my wife. She needs me. Stan, I have something to say to you. Go ahead. Stephanie is your daughter. I discovered that Bright wanted to have a DNA test at my back. So I decided to do something. thinking about you remember Roland right um yes as one of the ushers in church the one that has four kids well apparently he just discovered that only one out of those four kids is his you're joking I'm not the news is everywhere me I would say he brought this upon himself how yeah right you know sometimes it's always okay to let the sleeping dogs lie now he has ruined his family because of his stupid test
calm. <laughs> Can you just calm? No. I'm so hungry, I'm famished, and it's only a meal that can quench this thirst. <laughs> okay, don't worry. In five minutes, your food will be ready. Five minutes? Yeah. Promise? <laughs> I promise. Okay. <laughs> five minutes. Five minutes. <laughs> Yes. I got rid of him. Now listen to me. Here's the thing. If you do not divorce a former, I will go to the police and tell them you, Stanley, is an accomplice. <laughs> like I said, a woman in love can do anything. Welcome back, babe. Thank you. Stan, you don't have to do this. You don't have to stay with me out of pity. Just don't worry, I won't hurt myself again. my responsibility to take care of you and love you. I'm sorry. I mean, I know my affair with you that broke you down and I regret every bit of it. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. 
Yes. I know it will take a while for you to to forgive and trust me again. After all I made it pass through. But I'm here. I'll be here waiting. I, I can't do this anymore, Stanley. I can't. I, I just can't. Please. Interesting, right? You bet. <laughs> Why are you staring at me like that? I can't believe I almost lost you because of my foolishness. <laughs> Babe, that is in the past now. Can we just stop talking about it, okay? Can I join you? Of course, why not? Do you want to come up? Yeah, <laughs> so. Wait, my seat. Anywhere you want to sit. Alright, so. Stay. Are you sure you want it? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Is something wrong? Yes, yeah, something is wrong. What is it? From I can tell you now. But in no distance time I'll let you know. My plans.
I want us to settle this whole thing once and for all. You still don't believe me, do you? If you want this relationship to continue, you have to tell me the truth. Is Stephanie my daughter? Is she truly my daughter? If you don't believe me, why don't you go for a DNA test? So why didn't you tell me all this while? Why are you telling me now? He was better than you at that time. He had money, but you didn't. So tell me, if you were in my shoes, what would you have done? Killed bright because of all this. Because of money. I had to. I didn't want to lose everything. The cars, houses, money. I didn't want that to happen. So I had to kill him. But are you the devil himself? So you did all this because of money. You killed Bright because of all this. Now that I know I hate you so much. No. Stanley, I did it for us. No, you did it for yourself. You did it for your selfish interest. You greedy woman. No. Very wicked Stanley, woman. you know I love you. Don't, 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 don't you take home. Don't you!
I found this in the bedroom, babe. Why didn't you tell me the result was out? That's because I'm scared. But this is important. I mean, it is either she's your daughter or not. now and I will take very very good care of her I promise Where we go 